él es el bueno para la fiesta. Oh, the is here. Aha, okay. aha, what's the conversation about? What happened to you? Where are you? My internet is giving me problems, honestly. It took me like four minutes to access. I don't know what's the problem. I'm sorry. Don't worry. Hello, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. I'm so excited to see you. How was your day? Huh? How was your day today? Huh? Really good. Really? Why is that? Why is that? Hello? Go ahead. Go ahead. Why is that? Why was your day so good, huh? Did you or because did you? Because what's our day? I'm sorry, Kathy. Go ahead. What's a great day? I think all is very good. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. And what about you guys? How was your day? Raise your hand. Give your opinion. Raise your virtual hand and tell us how was your day? Anything special during your working day today, huh? Anything to share? Anything new? Anything you want to comment? Pay. <laughs> it's payday, huh? Yes. Did you get paid? <laughs> <laughs> The rat has fallen, huh? The rat <laughs> has fallen. Yes, That's today is the, the rat has fallen. <laughs> and for the reason, well, um, I'm so happy. And also, I'm here to continue learning English. Absolutely. And that's the best thing of all, finishing your day with an English class. It can't be better than that. You are investing your time wisely. You're not watching soap operas. You're not visiting friends. You're not drinking anything uh, inappropriate. You're not doing anything rather than learning English. Welcome to the class. I'm very excited to see you. I'm sorry, um, it took me like four minutes uh, to access the class, I'm going to try to cover or, 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 or make it up at the end. Hopefully you join me. And um, today we're going to have another English session. But before we get into that, we're going to go ahead and go over the attendance for today. Also, I want you to tell me some feedback about yesterday's class. Oh, almost forget. Did you, you did check the WhatsApp group. You got the response you were asking me for yesterday, right? You have the information um, about your previous teacher. So, now you are informed, very well informed about it, okay? Already it's then we're going to start with Lady Carolina Ventura. Are you in the house? Yes, present. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing tonight? I'm great. And you? I'm doing great. I can't complain. It's a nice day. And some people say we have to live your day as it was the last day, as it were the last day in your life. Maybe. Give your best all the time, huh? Yes. Do you do that? Yes, I prefer live day, day by day. Day by day, step by step, enjoying everything to the fullest. Thank you, lady. Let's go with Angel Antonio Benitez Ventura. Are you in the house? Yes, now I'm here in, well, today is, was a very stressed day because I had a lot of meeting with- uh, Meetings. Yes, uh, with a different uh, department of the, my company. And for that reason, I think it's title because I need to show a lot of report and also give us the, some advance about the, this month, the production, also the, the service, a lot of. A lot of things, okay. So you had to be in several meetings and make a lot of 
contact with a lot of departments. It means that you had a very busy, but at the same time, productive day. Thank you, Angel. Welcome to the class. Let me say welcome to Angela, Stephanie, Marroquin, Martinez. Are you there? Not yet. How about Carmen, Eugenia, Treminio, Reyes? Are you with us? Present, teacher. How are you doing tonight? Yeah. Are you ready to participate tonight? I'll be great tonight. Are you ready to give your best during the class? Yes. <laughs> always, always, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's important to go the extra mile, guys, always. Um, let's go with Daniel Archimedes Florentino Garcia. Are you here? Of course, I am here. Punctual as a as a as a as a as a watch, punctual as a clock. How are you doing tonight, Daniel? I'm feeling good, I'm really good. But my day was a little bit busy. I was a little bit busy, so but this uh, was a, a nice day. Yeah, on Tuesday, it's 15 of the month. Everybody's happy. The Everybody's energy. changing the mood. <laughs> Everybody's happy and yes, have a money. The, the energy makes it's different, happy huh? to me. Yeah, the people happy make me happy to me. <laughs> okay, the people, yeah. the happy people make you happy as well. Yes, of they, course. They transmit, uh, they yes. project that positive energy. And, and that's right, these days, everybody starts feeling different. Everybody's more smiley. Smile, Everybody says course. good morning. You know, yes. Yes. when it's the it's middle so of cool. the year, some people don't even say hello. And now uh -huh. everybody's friendly, huh? Uh -huh. Yes, of course. <laughs> Well, I love this season. I love this part of the year, but I think that we should enjoy every day as it was the last day of our lives, right? Daniel, let's go with Daniel Ezequiel Alvarez Mejia. Are you there? Maybe not yet. Estela Mar Mabel Orellana Andino. Present teacher. Let me see. How is everything, Miss? Are you ready for your class? I'm sorry, teacher. I'm I'm like a listener because I I I do um, homework for my university. I'm sorry, teacher. Mm, so I cannot push you like the other students. Good evening. Hey, good evening, Dan. I cannot ask you questions. I cannot ask you questions. I don't like that. Hmm. Okay. Anyways, I need to take it as it is. Jacqueline Jesenia Miranda Rodriguez, are you with us? Yes, I'm here. Welcome. What can you tell us about your day? Uh, well, it was so so stressful day, but uh, I I was working a lot, but I'm here. Uh, looking for a good experience with your class. You are in the right place, young lady. I hope we can count with your participation either through the microphone or via chat. But it's important to show that you're part okay. of this game, okay? Okay. Let's have fun. Jaime Antonio Avelar Cortez, are you there? Yes, good evening, everyone. Good evening. How are those feelings, huh? Um, I don't feel good. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Um, I I I was a a bad day today. <laughs> no kidding. Because, no, yes, it's really because my cell phone is broke. It's broken. Yes. What happened? Did you play it's... soccer with your cell phone, Mister? <laughs> No, no, no. It, um, as, as to as to Santa Claus for your cell phone. Because... Yes, I pray. I, I pray for for new cell phone. <laughs> you have been a good man this year, haven't you? Yes, I I am a good good man. Don't worry. <laughs> but uh, um, I am a, a a teacher. Yes, and and after after. After school, I I I'm 
I am in an extracurricular class. Mm -hmm. And today, um, I, 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 <laughs> I am in, check, check the list, the, the student and in, in drive and the, the cell phone is, is, is slipped, I don't know. It's slipped, your, it slipped it's from slipped. your hand. And fall oh. down in the, in the, in the floor. <laughs> Uh, and no more cell phone. Well, maybe you need a new cell phone. It was about time to upgrade your cell phone. Oh, maybe, maybe. And yes, I, I need to pay around to 150 years, 50 dollars. <laughs> yeah, I For imagine. But, and are you gonna lose the the pictures, the information, or or you can recover that? No, I don't lose because I I I have the this information in Drive. All right, that's wise. All right, we're sorry for your cell phone. We're gonna write a letter so you can get a new cell phone as soon as possible, Mr. Ajami. Welcome to the class. And then Jose Mayro Valdez Gomez, are you with us? Hello, teacher. Good evening. How's Everyone. it going, Mr. Valdez? I'm driving right now. All right. Be careful. Thank you. Let Thank us you. know. Let us know when you hit home so we can count on your participation. All right. Thank you. Okay. All right. Be safe. Let's go with Jose Rene Aguirre Chavarria. Where is it? Welcome, Mr. Rene. How's it going tonight? I'm, I'm very tired, but mm -hmm. tomorrow will be a worse day because oh. I have to travel a bit far to see projects and I hope to be on time mm -hmm. for class, although I doubt it. So you're telling me that tomorrow is very likely you're going to be very busy and you could get late to class. Yeah, I so, don't know. <laughs> so you're going to drive? Yes. Okay, be very careful on the street, Jose. Be careful on the street. Uh, drink some coffee, protect yourself, and be careful. Yes, thanks. No problem. Let's go with... Um, Let's see. I have Juan Jose Lara Bautista. Present. Good evening, sir. How are you doing? I'm going my home, my, to my house. You're on your way home? All right. What about Julio Cesar Merino Gonzalez? Here, teacher. I live in uh, kitchen. You're ready for it? Are you ready for your class? Yeah, I, I was. I was ready. I, I bought ready. I was born. I was, born. I, yes, was born. I was born ready. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was so yes, powerful. <laughs> yes. Okay, I want you to be with your pen and paper in case you need to take notes, participate to the fullest. Let's go with um, next participant, Catherine Lissette Cáceres Montesino. Present, mister. Hello, Hello. Miss Montesino. How's it going tonight? It's great. Thanks. And me? And my day? Thanks. How was your day? <laughs> I'm a special too. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> my day is great also, Miss, Miss uh, Montesino. Welcome to the class. I expect your participation as much as you can. All right? Yeah. All right, um, let's go with Catherine. Let me see. That's Katie Montesino, right? So K K Kathy or Katie, Denise Soriano Villacorta? I'm here. Where? Let me see, here. let me see, let me see. Oh, because you cannot activate your camera, can you? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, remember, it's part of, the, part of the requirements to have your camera activated. If you can, please do it. Let's go with Kenny Lisette Cuellar de Barrientos. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. 
Welcome, Manuel. How are you doing tonight? Thank you. Um, I <laughs> and, and now I I hope uh, the English class, but I I was working I was working in a report and I run and, and some calculates. It's about the it's about my report. It's now I correcting. For okay, the so you're working on some calculations. Yeah. <laughs> Because you are an accountant, right? No. <laughs> what do you do? I, uh, no, no, I am an agronomist engineer, but oh. I, I work in, I work in an advisor for a different company. It's the, the management environmental. That sounds a lot interesting, Manuel. Welcome to the session. We expect you. your participation tonight. Thank you. Osbin, Alexis Flores Hernandez, are you with us? Yes, teacher. How's it going, Osbin? Tell us about it. Very good, teacher. My oh, day yeah? Was, my day was very busy. I, busy? Busy because I had a lot of work. But it was a great day. I got more experience. I'm glad to hear that. I'm very happy to hear that. So it's time for you to continue with your English process, Osmin. I expect your participation tonight. Okay, thank you. Already, let's go with Sabrina, Lizette Garcia, Orellana. Are you with us, lady? Yes, I'm here. Smiley, Mr. Miss <laughs> Garcia, tell us about it. I'm great, teacher, and you? I'm super duper. I can't be better. Why are you great today? Why are you great today, Sabrina? Well, my day was very busy. Where um, I played news. I, I, I listened to music and I did all my job. And now I didn't finish. However, I was happy because I did so much. And I'm cute. And Ready you continue her. activated. You're a very active woman. You are very hardworking. Like we wish all Salvadorian women to be like that, right? People work and study at the same time. It's not easy, but it's not impossible either. Sabrina, let's go ahead and start. Welcome to your class. Thank you, teacher. Absolutely. Marielos, Janet, Cornejo, Erazo, are you there? Teacher. Welcome to the class, lady. Julio Cesar Ramirez Arevalo. Luis Alberto Galicia Gertrudis. Cristian Josue Lopez Perez. Okay. Hello. Oh, Cristian, there you are. What's going on, Cristian? I am very good. Oh really? Do you do do you do jet ski? Do you do jet ski, Christian? Yeah, a little. It's a little. Do, are you, uh, can you surf? No, I can't. You I can't, can't surf. surf. Okay, okay, okay. Feedback from last class. What do you remember, guys? What do you remember from yesterday's class? What did we study last night? Do you remember? That Samsung is the best mark. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Study. I remember that in my family, we, we call to Samsung, to cell phone Samsung, Samurai. Samurai? Why do <laughs> you call them I like was, that? Because when I was eight or 10 years old, my first cell phone was Samsung. And it fell down too much time and it was nice. Too many times, For okay. That? It fell down yes. too many times, many times. and it still yes. work. Yes, yes, and for that we call him Samurai. <laughs> the survivor, huh? The fighter, the warrior. Yeah, that's true, that's true. So anyways, yesterday we were talking about how to use an adjective plus enough, right? That was uh, the class last night and it was very, very interesting. So tonight we're going to continue uh, talking about 
uh, features and products. I want to share with you my screen. Hopefully I don't get disconnected this time. Let me see, here it goes. Please let me know if you can visualize it now. Let me know, please. Not yet. In process. Can you see it now? Yes. Okay, great, great, great. In that case, let's go over the activity A, I'm sorry, six building vocabulary is as much the words or expressions to their meanings. There, there we have a list of expressions. Let me see if you have any question about them. Number one is product design. Can you repeat product design? Product design. Product design. What do you understand by product design? Any volunteer? Raise your virtual hand. Me, well, teacher. Go ahead. Um, the product design is to create a new a new product to be sold by a boss in the customer. All right, all right. Thank you for your thoughts. Okay, we'll find out a little more information about it. Number two is after sale services. Repeat after sale services. After, after sale, sale services. 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 Nice pronunciation. What do you think we meant with this expression, Osbin? What do you think after sale service? I, I have my, my what do you think no problem no problem what what about you uh, lady go ahead after sales service what idea comes to you the help and information that is provided to customer after they have bought a particular product Okay, so it's sort of a process, right, that happens after making the sale. All right. It's like a, it's like a follow-up activity, right? Awesome. Let's go with brand. What do you understand by brand? Do we have any volunteer? Raise your hand. Raise your virtual hand. If not, let's ask Sabrina, what's your opinion about a brand? What comes to your mind? Do you know the meaning? Can you explain? It's like a marca, something like that. How do you explain that in English, though? Is it, is it what we think? Is what? What we think? Is what when, we think? What we think while when we hear something, for example, if we are if we hear the the, the mark Samsung, the brand, the brand Samsung, we think that is a good product. It's like a reputation of a yeah, product. Yeah, that's true. It's it's like a big company, right? With with its own name that is recognized um, nationally or internationally. Um, like like what? Like like Coca Cola, for example. That's a worldwide brand that is known everywhere. What about features? Features. Repeat. Features. 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 Is like the characteristic yes, of the sir. sound product. Yes, for example. Oh, for example, uh, the cell phone. Uh -huh. Maybe they have a lot of characteristics like uh, the good features. camera. Uh, the features, a uh, good camera, and also uh, different uh, different things that the to. I don't know how do you say lo hacen único. That makes it unique. Ah, okay. Thank you. Yes, it's true. Cell phones have so many features, such as a camera, such as Bluetooth. Ooh, what's that? What's that? I like it. I like it. 
<laughs> for example, the storage, the battery life, all of those on characteristics. In other words, features. The term is features. Use it, okay? Let's go with number five is product positioning. Repeat, product positioning. 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 What do you understand by that? Do we have any volunteer that wants to participate? Otherwise, let's choose one big team. Let's go with Manuel. Let's give me a, what do you understand when you hear this term product positioning? Product positioning. Mm -hmm. Is 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 like the demand of the product? It's like a a demand. It's of like the, the demand of the product. It has to do. It has to do with the demand of the product because if you have a lot of demand of your product, is because you have already established a good position within the market. So thank you so much for your contribution. What we're going to do now is that we're going to match the words or expressions to their meanings. Here, you could see the meanings. So what we're going to do is that you're going to match them up, okay? Match them up. I'm gonna give you seven minutes for you to analyze everything and for you to uh, match them up, okay? Then we're going to have a talk and you're going to give your opinions about it. Do you understand? Are you ready? Yes or no? Sabrina? Yeah. Okay, everybody. Okay, you have seven minutes. Let's go ahead and match them up. I'll be back with you in seven minutes. No, 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 wait, wait, wait.
already, already. Let's get started. I hope you get it or you have it done. Everybody finished? Yes or no? Did you finish? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. All right, awesome. Okay, in that case, let's go ahead and compare what you got. For example, for a uh, product design, which is number one, product design, what you got as an answer? I think is the process of creating an imaging of a product in the means of the customer. Okay, the process of creating, okay? The process of creating an image, okay? Of a okay. product in the minds, in the minds of the customers. Do you agree with that, guys? Do you agree with him? Yes, teacher. Everybody agrees? I agree. Does everybody agree? I think oh. that it was the uh, the fourth one in the in the second column. One, two, three, four. I think is it to create a new product to be sold by a business to its customers. I agree I, with Sabrina. I yes, agree I with agree Sabrina. with Sabrina. Yes. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> awesome. That is the way we make it happen. So it's the fourth one, right? Can you repeat it again? To create a new product to be sold by a business to its customers. Okay, so that is definitely the right answer. That's the product design. It, it, it's similar because this one has the word creating. So we're not that... Uh, wrong, right? But the, me, the main one is this one, yeah, to create a new product to be sold by a business to its customers. So that will be number one, right? What about number two? After... Just, just one thing, teacher, just one thing. Uh, uh, Mr. Jaime, I have one point. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with that, Mr. Jaime? Any comment? We always fight I always fight with Mr. Jaime. <laughs> you always you always compete with him, huh? Yes. <laughs> and that's the first model. <laughs> All right, not a problem. Not a problem. Let me just try to get your faces because I wanna see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Hopefully I can get it right here no it doesn't show it for some reason okay so let's go over number three that's brand what do you have for brand people i think brand is the use of a name term symbol or this or design to give the product oh, to a product unique identify in the marketplace i think the use of a name, term, symbol, or design to give a product a unique identity in the market. Do you agree with him, people? Yeah, of course. Of course, he's right. Congratulations. Everybody does? Everybody agrees? Yes. yes. Okay, I think that was that was right, definitely right. Number four, we already talked about this one. Features, features. What do you have as an answer for this? Characteristics. Characteristics. Go, 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 I love it. Characteristics. <laughs> the third one in the second column. Correct, characteristics of a, of a product that describe its appearance, components, and capabilities. Do you have any questions so far? Any comment to say? So far, so good. Okay. Then the last one is product positioning. Obviously, what answer can we mention?
Hello? The process of creating an image of a product in the minds of the consumers. It, in other words, uh, having your product recognized, having uh, people know and recognize the name of your company, the logo of your company, right? So that is a very difficult process. Um, in your opinion, uh, which of these processes is, is the most complicated, in your opinion, product design, after sales services, brand features or product positioning it will be pretty interesting for me to know your opinion what do you think kathy montesino well maybe to the position positioning of the product because um some people are like familiarizing with familiarized familiarized with other products so you need to to um, call their attention with the new products. That's totally right. I agree with you. Plus, there is a lot of competition out there, you know? So that makes it even harder. What's your opinion about it? What's the most difficult? One more opinion. Let's go with a volunteer. Do we have any? Nope. Otherwise, let's move on, guys. Let's move on. We got to move on. Let's go with the book. And here we have an exercise. It says, well, this one is a little difficult because we're not using the, um, the physic book, right? But we can give it a try. It says, label, label the examples of elements found in a product strategy using the questions from the box. Here we have some questions. Let me see. I'm going to ask. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. This one is going to help me. I'm going to ask Julio. Let's go, Julio. Can you read the questions, please? Um, how will you distribute? Distribute. You proud, distribute your product. Yes. How okay. will you distribute? Distribute your product. Yes. We are we are you selling to who? Who? Oh, who? Who are you selling to? Who are you what? selling to? Who are you selling to? Okay, thank you so much, Julio. Thank you for okay. your participation. Let me listen to Angel. Who are you selling to? Can you continue with the next questions? Oh, mm, what value do you provide your customer? Okay, what value? Repeat, value. value. What value do you provide your customer? Customers, pronounce me the S, for customers, customers. Because you want to um, show value to a lot of customers, right? To make a lot of uh, sales. Next question. Okay, by Carmen Terminio, help us with the next question. What are you selling? Selling. Selling. What are you selling? Yes. And Christian, help us with the last question. Go ahead. Christian, okay. Let's go with Daniel Florentino. Help us with the last question. How will you price your product? How will you price your product? So these are uh, questions that we need to kind of label here because we have the answers. Let's go over the answers. Let's go with, let me see. Oops, no, chat, no. I want to see your names here. Okay, here. Let me go with a well, different participant. What about Jacqueline Miranda? Are you there, Jacqueline? Yes, no, maybe. Okay, here we have answer one. We build quality kitchen hardware for residential kitchen customers. 
we build quality kitchen hardware for residential kitchen customers. What do you think the question is for this answer? Any volunteer? Julio, me teacher. Go ahead. And uh, what are you selling? Okay, what are you selling? What are you selling? Yeah. All right, does everybody, does everybody agree with him? I agree. You are right, I agree. Mr. Julio. Agree, yes. Yes, yes one 100%. point. 100%, one point, huh? <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go over answer two. Answer two, let's go Jaime. Share answer two, Mr. Avalar. Our customers are young North American families who want who want kitchen uh, hardware. Uh, sorry, I can't see. It's sorry, hard. I'm sorry. Start again. Wait. Okay. Hardware that can extend that we are and tear of young children. Okay. Okay. Customers, remember to pronounce me the letter S when you talk about plurals. Or customers, customers. are young, customers. north, north, give me the north, young, north, north American north. families who want kitchen hardware that can stand the wear and tear of young children. So, what do you think the question is? Who are you selling? Correct. Well, Do you agree with well, that, guys? Agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. One hundred percent. One hundred percent. What What are you selling to? Um, who, who, are you? who are Who are you, who are you selling? selling? Yes, because we're talking about people. Remember, and who asks for people? So the question is, who are you selling to? We're selling to our customers, customers that are young North American families who want kitchen hardware. Yeah, that's the right one. Let's go with the next answer. Kathy Soriano, help us with the next answer. Three. All right, let's go with Miss Lady Ventura. Help us with answer three, can't you? Okay, how will you distribute your product? Oh, that was the question already. You already got it. Yes. Okay. So the answer is they are they interested. are interested in materials that are safe for children and eco-friendly. And eco-friendly, yes, eco materials. So the correct question is again. How will you distribute? your product how will you distribute your product mm, they are interested in materials that are safe for children and eco-friendly um do you agree guys no no maybe the question will be what values to do do you provide to your customer let's analyze yes, that I agree. Yes, what I agree. value do you provide your customers and the answer is they are interested in materials that are safe. So safe oh, sure. is a value. And? Yes, yes. I, I don't see the correct answer in my notebook. And I mistake. That is. Say, say, uh, say. The say. question is what value do you provide your customer? That is okay. Because the, uh, the question is first, the answer is next. <laughs> yes. Sorry, teacher. I no, confused. no, don't be sorry. Now, one correction for you. You say, you say, I was mistaken. I was mistaken. Yes. Okay. No problem. No problem. Thank you for your clarification. That's what it's all about. Let's go with the number four. Answer number four. Let's go with the next participant. That's Sabrina. Go ahead. Our products are priced per unit and are considered high. Wait, 
wasn't it number four, your I lady? I see four, 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 sorry. Are you in a rush? <laughs> we sell our products throughout a retail channel. Through, and through. Through. Through, through. Through. Mm -hmm. Through a retail channel. We and sell our product. What is the question? Can you, well, the, the screen. And, how will you distribute, distribute your product? Okay, this pronunciation is distribute. distribute. Repeat, guys, distribute. 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 Again, distribute. Distribute. How will you distribute your product? And he says, we sell our products through a retail oh, channel. Retail. Yes. And number five, number five, let's go with Mr. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Daniel, let me see the other Daniel. Where's the other Daniel? Let me see, that's Daniel. Ezekiel. Hi, teacher. Go are? ahead, Daniel. <laughs> I want to hear you too. Can you go ahead? In number five. Yes, sir. Our products are priced per unit and are considered high end hardware solution. Mm. Uh, let me check um, our products like price. Uh, can you scroll the page? What do you think? Scroll up. What what value do you provide your customers? I think, mm, I think we already used that one. Our products are priced per unit. And are considered high tech. Guys, what do you understand with this expression? High end. High end. What is the what is what is your interpretation? What's in the high end? Gamalta. Correct. Technologically oh. the best, right? At the moment. Cons they are considered high end. All right. So what is you the correct question? About the price. What is the correct question? How would you price your product? Do you agree, people? Yes. Yeah. Because it's talk about the price. Yeah, I agree. Correct. Very, very, right. very agree. Very agree. <laughs> All right. <laughs> nice job. Congratulations. Congratulations. Let's move on. Let's move on on unit number two. Let's move on. Let's see. Here we have. The objective is to recognize the components of the place and promotion strategies of a famous national product or service. So we need to find out the components of the place and the strategies they use when it comes about promotions. Here we have a question. It says, what is the process? What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called? How important is placement to reaching the right target audience a very very solid questions i think that there is a big logistic uh, process done behind behind the scenes a lot of people working a lot of people organizing the stuff and we're gonna find out about this type of processes here let's go over this um, conversation that we have Sophia is discussing some ideas about the place to distribute the product, about the place they distribute the product. Uh, we're gonna read the conversation and take turns practicing it. Um, let's go over the pronunciation. Ready? Listen completely and repeat completely. Here we go. I would like to sell training courses online. I would like to, I would sell, like training to sell training courses online. 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 Courses. 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 I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place 
like a store to sell them. I have, I have developed a few, but I am not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. What is the pronunciation of this verb? Develop. 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 Is pronunciation T, right? Develop. Correct. Develop. It's like the verb help, helped with the T sound, right? Let's go. I think the place is actually irrelevant. I think, I think, I think place. the place is, is actually irrelevant. irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. You, you have, have to take, to take advantage, advantage of, of access. access. Of access. Repeat. Advantage. 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 Again, advantage. 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 Take advantage. Take advantage. 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 What do you mean? What do you mean by access? What do you mean? What do you mean by access? What do you mean by access? By access. You could sell your training courses online. You could sell your training courses online. Again, polish the pronunciation. Could. 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 You could sell your training you courses online. You, you could, could sell, sell your training, training courses, courses online. online. Wonderful, guys. Let's continue. It says, people are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. People, people are always people using are their phones to serve their learn new things. Wonderful. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. This is, is a great, great because you, you can create awareness about your social networks and interest in so that you will buy them. Buy them. Did you understand the conversation? Do you have any question about it? Awareness. Awareness is como hacerlo del conocimiento, ¿verdad? Create awareness about your product. So it's like promoting your product on the networking sites, on the social networking sites. So that people, so that people can see, people can uh, realize about your product. That is awareness. Any other question? Okay, I have a question for you. What is this conversation about? What is this conversation about? Any volunteer? It's about a new service with the, she had to uh, launch them. And the uh, best friend may be recommended because it's, it's a great idea. What kind of product or service they want it's to sell? About it's about training courses. Training courses online. It's about selling training courses online, huh? Yeah. How interesting is this? Uh, nowadays, it is really a necessity, right? To be updated 
and it's a great tool to have these online classes from your home you can be able to prepare yourself so that's marvelous uh, let's go over the practice before we go to the questions okay let me have all the gel all, all the ladies practice sophia's role and all the gentlemen uh, will practice arnold's role i want you to uh, speak up okay if there's no noise in your background you can open your microphone and speak up uh, to the fullest so i can hear your pronunciation and perhaps make any observation our correction please let's do Teacher, it yes maybe i think that it's better uh, read for by by one because you um you listen better because it's one by one when you uh, tell us uh all reading is the, the the same time is difficult you think so I am Maybe. able to catch mispronunciations, but we can do it that way as well. I'm here to satisfy you. You are the customers and you are always right. So let's do it that way. Although I'm gonna need you to be very activated for you to participate, okay? Okay. So we're gonna start with someone, let me see, let me see, let me see. We're gonna start with, why don't we start with Julio and Kathy, yeah? Julio and Kathy, we're not gonna have all of you doing it because, because of the time, but we're gonna do our best. Okay, ready? Ready, yes. ready? Set, let's go. Okay. I'm Sophia. Yes. Yeah. I would like to sell training courses online. I have de developed a few, but I am not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think it, I think the price is actually actually is there. Excuse me, irrelevant. You you have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could say you're trying a course online. People are always using their phone to surf the web and alert net, net, net things. This is great because you can create our awareness about your product for, from social network networking size and create an enough interest in your course to tell people will buy them. Yes, we definitely have some observations. In your case, um, let me see, let me see, let me see. Miss Katie, you did well, you did well. I didn't find any observation, but in um, Julio's, Let's see, for example, actually, repeat, actually. 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 And then actually. advantage, I think this one is a little difficult. Advantage. Advantage. Advantage, advantage. yes. Remember, uh, some of you are failing on pronouncing the letter S on the plurals. And it's very oh, okay. important you do that. In this case, it's courses. 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 Because it's plural. Course, this yeah, case, yeah. Fonts. 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 Because it's plural. Fonts. Yes. Yeah. Adjective. New. 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 New things. things. New. Pronounce the S. New, new things. New things. Yes. Awareness. Yeah. Awareness. Awar awareness. Okay, interest, enough it, interest. It, enough interest. Enough, enough. Enough, enough interest. Thank you. Let's listen to Lady. Why don't we listen to Lady and Daniel Florentino? You start, Lady. Go ahead. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I, sh I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. 
people are always using their phone to surf the web and learn new things. This is a great because you can create awareness about your product from social, social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. It sounded very nice. It sounded very good. Uh, observations, observations. The T sound, the T sound on developed, I need to get it. I need to get it. Because the developed. simple question is developed. You just close because of the P, you close your lips, develop. That's the present. Developed. But in simple past, you put the T, developed. Developed. Yes. And also okay. here on the module verb, can you please polish it up? It says should. 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 Yes. Yes. That's all. That's all on your end. And with my gentleman, let's see. Let me just check. This part was perfect. Maybe we could try to practice a little more this pronunciation of advantage. 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 Try to practice the advantage and the antonym that is the opposite is disadvantage. Disadvantage, disadvantage is negative. Disadvantage. disadvantage. And advantage, advantage is advantage. affirmative. Okay. Now, now be careful, be careful because little mistakes make a difference. Again, again, you're not pronouncing the S on plurals. It's phones. very important. Phones. phones. Uh, that was pretty much it. I really like your performance. Nice job. Thank you. All right, just one last performance, guys. Just one last because we need to move on, okay? I want to hear Sabrina and Ospin. Why don't we go with you guys? I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phone to search the web and learn new things. This is a great because you can create awareness about your product for, from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that scroll that up please scroll it can you see it yes in the courses so that people will buy them Okay, okay, I appreciate it. Wow, Sabrina, you sound amazingly. I really like your pronunciation and I also like your intonation. Uh, maybe guys, we could increase your intonation when you make a question. Remember that you gotta use rising intonation when you finish it. What do you mean by access? It's like, it's like uh, uh, the, the intonation changes, right? Because you make the question. Okay, I really like your intonation, your pronunciation on the simple past. And let me see, again, again, with the gentleman, we're failing with the plurals, again, phones. Uh, here, this word awareness, awareness, awareness. Uh, here, this um, adjective, social, social, okay? Social networking sites. Now? If you don't have any question, we can move on to the exercise. It says, look at the conversation and answer the questions below. What does, what does Sophia want to sell? What isn't, what isn't she sure about? And what are Arnold's recommendations? Do you think we can do it right now or you need me to give you a couple of minutes? Okay, I'm gonna give you five minutes. What do you say? I'm gonna give you five minutes. I'm gonna make it smaller so you can be able to see 
the conversation as well as the questions. Let me see. Yeah, that's the best I can do. All right, I'll give you five minutes, guys. Answer the questions and we'll talk in a bit. Tiny course. Guys, if you finish before the five minutes, let me know. Are you ready? No, yes. Not yet, not yet, okay. Always, always let me know if you finish so we can start or we can comply <laughs> with the time assigned. In this case, it's five minutes. We still have two minutes and a half. I finish. Okay, okay, very well. Let's wait um, two more minutes, okay, for the rest of your classmates. Already good enough. 
good enough. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let me activate my camera. Here we go. Let's talk about it. Number one, what does Sophia want to sell? Try a course. Give me the complete structure. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll like to send it through, Sophia. Almost, almost, courses. almost, Cours. almost. Who wants to help Julio? Sophia. Course online. Yes. Sophia wants to sell training Two. courses online. Ooh, magnificent. Now, did you say Sophia? What is next, Sophia? Once. Once. Correct. That is one way of saying it. Sophia wants to sell online training courses. The other way is Sophia would like, yes, Sophia would like to sell training courses online, right? Good job, yeah. people, great job. Let's go over question two, it says, what isn't she sure about? Any volunteer? Me, Go she, ahead. Isn't she isn't sure about the place. Do you agree, guys? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Um, I like to start to sell them. I I'll say that again. Is is so is so is so get a price like a store to sell yeah. them. Yeah, so she isn't sure about the place. She isn't sure about the location. Okay, and number three, what are Arnold's recommendations? Arnold's recommends a training course online. Say that again. Arnold recommend or Arnold recommend, recommends? Recommends. Sell training course online. Okay, Arnold recommends to sell uh, trainings online. Do you agree, guys? More or less. More or less. Do you yes. have something different? Yeah. Um, I think um, Sophia could sell sell. Um, Training course or courses only. Online. online. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yes. It's Everybody. My <laughs> it's all right. It's your right. You you agree, guys, with this answer, or you wanna have something different? <laughs> Sophia. Yeah, about Sophia, about Arnold's recommendation. This is Arnold's recommendation. What did Arnold recommend it, recommend Sophia to do? What do you have in your answer, uh, Angel Benitez? About number three. three. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, so Arnold recommendations is uh, uh, that sell um, training courses online uh, because the people pass all the times in a cell phone. Okay, say so spend because people spend okay. all the time on their phones, right? That is a right answer. Do you agree, guys? Do you agree with Angel? Teacher. Yeah, I agree. You agree. Go ahead, Miss. Just that I don't understand the conversation because they are talking about training courses online, and after they are they are talking about sell uh, uh, phones, and I'm not sure. Mm, not about not about cell phones. Uh, what mm -hmm. Arnold said. Well, well, yes, yes. They are having uh, a conversation about a new idea that Sophia has, 
And, and Sofia's idea is that she wants to sell training courses online. Um, Arnold is giving advice and recommendations to her. Like you have to take advantage of the access. The place is actually irrelevant. Now, Sofia is asking questions to Arnold because Arnold has experience. And Arnold suggests that she could definitely sell the training courses. And the reason why is because he says that people nowadays, people all the time are using the phones. And remember that on the phone, you can connect to Wi-Fi and you can easily click on the link and connect to a class online. So you can use your phone not only for entertainment, but also for learning purposes. So that's the idea that Arnold said on this conversation. Thank you, teacher. My pleasure, my pleasure. Let's go ahead and move on. Let me do something here real quick. Give me one second. Let's see here. We have something else right here. Just bear with me a moment, please. Okay, I'm gonna send you a link for you to study a little bit of information about this topic. Let me know if you can, you can, you can put it on your agenda so you can check this information at a later time. It's for you to increase your, your knowledge. It's for you to get new vocabulary. It's for you to read. Do you like reading? I think reading is, is very good for intermediate students. Do you practice your reading, guys, or you don't have time to do so? Hello? So, so, teacher. Mm, okay, that is not good at all because Reading in my, uh, my case, help. I haven't time enough to read. I'm sorry, can you I, repeat? I, I haven't time to read. You don't I have time. Yes, yes, of course. So it's very difficult because we, when, when I back to my home, it's very late. I need to eat, eat my dinner and receive the English class. Yeah, for it, when I, I haven't time to read. You don't have time for reading. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> I know you're very busy, but uh, you can take only 10 minutes, five minutes of your time and have some reading. Reading will help you to learn a lot of new vocabulary. Let me share with you this link real quick. And if someone can help me uh, passing it uh, through the WhatsApp chat, that would be amazing. Unfortunately, my internet connection is not that good. I cannot do many things at the same time, sadly. Let me check the other one right here. Let's see, I just passed you one. Teacher. Yes, sir. In, in my case, my, my reading is good and up. Okay, do you like reading? Yeah. Yes, my reading is is not good. It's not good. It's it's not. It's enough. It's, it's good enough. enough. It's good enough. Good, oh, okay, good okay. Enough. Yeah. I'm sending you another link on the on the uh, chat here on on um on Zoom. If you can help me passing them to the WhatsApp chat, that would be very very uh, helpful. Okay. Let's go ahead and continue with our session. We're going to move on on to page number, let me see, 23, if I'm not mistaken. Let me share my screen once again. Here goes. Can you see my screen now, guys? Yeah. All right. Not perfect. yet. Not yet. No yet. Not yet, teacher. Not yet. Oh, oh yeah. It's okay. Already. You got it now? Okay, cool, cool, cool. So right there, we have the continuation. We're talking about enough. Now with nouns. Remember that last night we learned an adjective plus enough. So tonight is a little bit different, as you may see. Uh, 
it says how to use enough with nouns. Uh, first of all, first of all, what is a noun? Who can tell what a noun is? Do we have a volunteer? Let me ask, uh, let me see, Catherine Montesino, can you explain what a noun is? <gasps> oh my God. Uh oh. I don't know how to explain. <laughs> no problem, no problem. We're going to ask for help. How about if um, Kathy Soriano help you? Can you, Kathy? Uh, really, I'm not sure, but enough. It's like uh, something okay or... Wait, wait, wait. My question no. is about nouns. Here, N-O-U-N-S. What is a My noun? Nouns mm -hmm. is like... A, I don't know. Maybe I think that is like the way that you can describe people, things, and all those. Mm, somewhat, somewhat correct. Let's ask for help to Kenny Cuellar. Can you help us, Kenny? What is a noun? Can you clarify this for us? Okay, because this is something basic. Let's go with Jose Mario. Can you explain what a noun is? I have a problem with this. <laughs> okay. Let's play. But uh, you have problems. Uh -huh. <laughs> I, I don't know, teacher. No problem. Moment. No problem. No problem. I understand. No worries. Just listen. Just listen. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's have one last opportunity. Let me try. Sabrina, can you try to explain what a noun is? Is who's, who's we are talking about in a sentence? For example, the house is big. The noun is house, is the house. <laughs> yes, absolutely right, Ms. Sabrina. A noun, guys, a noun can be anything. It can be a person. It can be a, an object. It can be an animal. It can be a place, it can be a thing, anything, okay? It's clear? Mm, you don't sound sure. <laughs> Do you wanna give examples of nouns? Let's give examples of nouns. Can you say examples? Brainstorm examples, brainstorm examples of nouns now. Go ahead. The car, the Go sofa, um, the house, the street, the, the airplane, the, the airplane, the, 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 the park, the park, the beach, the whatever, the chair, the table, the computer. Can I say, can I say my brother, my brother, can I say that as a noun? Yes. yes, because it's a person. Correct, correct. What about if I say a name? Can I say, for example, uh, Catherine Montesino? Yes. Yeah, yeah it's a person. Did well. you say uh, something about her? Yeah. That is correct. That is correct. Remember, we have nouns and we also have subject pronouns, which is easier for you. Um, so we're going to learn a little bit with using enough plus nouns. OK, let me ask for um, Osbin. Can you help me, Osbin? Can you read the information, please? The highlighted information. Can you read it? Okay. Enough is a word that can qualify an advert or an adjective. It can also be used before a noun. Listen, enough is a word 
that can qualify either an adverb or an adjective. So enough is a very powerful word. It can be used before a noun. Usually it goes before a noun. Let's go over some examples. Let's start with Daniel Florentino. First example, please. The company does not have enough information about the customers to understand their needs. Hmm does not have enough information. Okay, sir, what is the what is the noun in this example? Information. Information, that's totally right. So the company does not have enough. Remember the F, F sound, enough. You mean enough. I need, enough. To, I need to hear the F. I need to hear the F sound, enough. 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 Mm. enough. 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 I, I, okay, enough information about the customers. All right, let's go with next participant. That's uh, Jose Rene Aguirre. Continue with the next example. Thank you. Let's go with Catherine Montesino. You can help us now, Catherine. Can you repeat? Yes, the second example, can you read it out for us? Use your best pronunciation. Yeah, we design enough promotion to create a short term increase in sales. Hmm, did you pronounce the letter S here? Promotion or promotions? We design enough promotions to create a short term increase in sales. Correct. And what is the pronunciation of this verb in simple past? Simple present is design. Repeat, guys. Design. 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 Now, what is the simple past pronunciation? Is it D? Is it T? Or if? I think design. it's Ed. You think it's? Ed. Mm. Design. 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 Designed, designed, designed with a T, designed. with a D, D, designed, 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 D, like oh, okay. D, uh -huh. designed, designed. Okay. We designed, designed enough promotions to create a short term. I have a question. Sales, yes. With is enough or enough? Enough. It, it's not with E. Enough. I mean, the first letter is E. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but what do you pronounce? It doesn't sound like E. No, it's, it's no. I say enough. Enough. The, the correct enough. word, the correct pronunciation is enough. Yes. Well, enough. remember that pronunciation is uh, is another topic, right? Because in the United States, some people may say enough. Enough. Yeah. Uh, so That's why I'm varies. confused. No, don't be confused. Don't be confused. Remember that people from the South speak a little different than people from the North and people from the West. They have a little different accent. You can say enough. You can say enough. That's not a problem. Okay. No, and enough. I just know that I just know that share pronouns enough in the song. <laughs> <laughs> enough. Enough. Hey? That's why it's important listening Enough. to songs in English, huh? That's true. That's true. Okay, let's go over the next example. Let's go with Carmen. Carmen Treminio. Can you help us, Carmen? Yes. This strategy may be used to distribute enough products. How do you pronounce this, Carmen? Distribute. Distribute, okay, distribute. Distribute enough, enough products. All right, I like that. Let's go with the next example by Angel Benitez. Oh, this is the, the number four. Yes, sir. The store needs to sell enough temp items to continue in business. 
Okay, Angel, how do you pronounce this word? Items. Items. Close your lips and give the S sound. Items. items. There items. you go. Okay. What, is, what is the singular form? Item. And an, items. An, an item. Okay. All right, good enough. Thank you so much. Let's go with Lady. Can you help us with the last example, miss? Okay. There were not enough spurs to perform the task. Okay, let's pronounce perform. Give me the M sound. Perform. 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 And here we need to say experts. 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 Very good job. Well done. Well done. Well done. So as you see, we have enough plus a noun, enough information, enough promotions, enough products, enough items, enough experts. So enough is a very useful word on a daily basis, guys. Remember that you can use enough plus an adjective, or you can use enough plus a noun. Here we have an exercise. Complete the sentences using the information in parentheses and enough. Then we're going to compare. It's five exercises, so I'm going to give you five minutes to complete, all right? Is it, is it enough? <laughs> Is it enough time? Yes. All right, let's go for it.
Time is up. Time is up. Let's see what you got, guys, for question number one or exercise number one, because it's not a question. Um, do we have a volunteer? Go ahead, volunteers. Volunteers. Raise your virtual hand. Who wants to go? Me, teacher. Go ahead, Angel. Okay. I think is the the marketing department hasn't enough create interest. Okay. I think it, it must be adjusted, Daniel. Somebody has a different answer. I have the marketing department hasn't create enough interest. I have the marketing department has a, hasn't enough interest in create a photo shoot. You're very close. You're very close. Now, if you're gonna use a preposition in your example, the next verb must go with ing. Now, who has a different way? Uh, me. Go ahead. In in my answer, in my sentence, say. The marketing department hasn't enough interest to create. create. It still, still needs to be adjusted. Somebody has a different way. Go ahead. Now, now you need to note, you need to note that we're using hasn't. No. Did, did you did the you notice that? The marketing department no. No, no, no. Wait. We're using hasn't. What is that telling you? What what tense is it? What structure do you need Present to use? Perfect. Yes. Created. Correct. Hasn't Correct. Enough interest. Yes. Bingo. <laughs> what comes after the auxiliary hasn't? You need to use the verb in PP verb, PP form, past participle, not create, but with the letter D because this is regular verb, created. Yes? The can marketing you, uh, department. I'm sorry? Can, can you write that? I can dictate it. For example, the marketing department hasn't created enough interest okay repeating it the marketing department hasn't created enough interest congratulations to the ones who did it that way good job Woohoo! this is challenging guys this is challenging let's see what you got for number two do i have a volunteer for number two me teacher. Go ahead, go for it. No, no, do me. What? Um all, all product and all offer. Offer enough to, offer? Enough offer. Are you sure? Um benefits and all yeah, um benefits. That's not right. Can somebody help us, please? Help, students. Our, our products offer enough features and benefits. Do you agree with her, guys? Can you repeat it, lady, please? Our products offer enough features and benefits. Now, pronounce me the letter S. The first time you pronounce the letter S, features and ah, benefits. Okay. Our product offer enough features and benefits. Do you agree with her? Students, 
Talk to me. Yes, no, maybe, no, teacher, I have it differently, teacher. Uh, teacher, I am confused. Teacher, I'm not understanding. Uh-huh. Any comments? Maybe it's confused, teacher. You think so? Really? That... Now, remember that this is the subject. Maybe... I'm this, tired. Yeah, maybe. Now, remember that this is a subject. This is a subject. It's followed by a verb. Yeah? It's followed by a verb. And then you need to introduce enough. And then you need to introduce features, which is a noun. Remember, our products, our products, repeat, our products offer... Repeat, oh. our products. Our products. You're not pronouncing as guys. Our products. Our, our, our products. products. I'm our telling products. you, we're not, we don't manage one product. We are a big company. We have products. a lot of products. Come on. Products. Our products. Products. Verb. Our products offer. Repeat, okay. our, our products our offer. Products offer. Now you need to introduce enough. Our products offer enough. Repeat. Our, our products, our products offer, offer enough. 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 Noun. Noun. Enough. Features, Features and benefits. benefits. Follow the pattern. Follow the order, right? After the uh, now, I mean, the subject, you need to use the verb in parentheses. Hopefully, we can make it better on number three. Do I have a volunteer for number three? That the, the current is um, T-shirt. Give me a second. The correct for, for you is our products offer enough futures and benefits. Correct. That's the right <laughs> one. But and, uh, if this is correct in the, the platform is ground because I write in this answer and tell me that it's ground. Oh, but the, the platform is, is an exercise, right? It's, it's, it's... Yes. It's the same exercise, teacher. It's the same and exercise. I, because, it, because I say, I told you that it's confused to me. And it's confusing. It's, but it's confusing to me, but in the platform, it's the same. It's the same exercise. And I'm writing right now in the, uh, in the platform, in the answer is incorrect. That's weird. Yes, teacher. I can't. Can you check, can, guys? Can you check on the platform right now? I don't have access right now. But can can some of you check on the platform if, if she's right, if there's any problem? Because, you know, the platform, sometimes there are some uh, glitches, some system glitches that affect uh, the answer being correct, even though you're, you're putting it correctly. So it's important to find out if there is a system glitch or if the answer is different in that case. Um, check guys check and let me know on the chat tomorrow uh, I would like to verify that mm -hmm. but according to the rule according to the explanation uh, we're gonna yes. use we're gonna use enough and we're gonna use a noun afterwards so remember that these are verbs these are verbs what they are giving us what they are giving us in the exercise are verbs this is not a noun Okay, the noun is afterwards. Interest yes. is the noun. Features and benefits is the noun. Channels yeah. of distribution is a noun. Goods and sell them, it's a noun. Information on the competition is a noun. So after using the verb, you introduce the word enough. And after that, you add the noun. That's the rule. Check on the examples. Check on the examples. The company does not, does not, does not, the company does not have, is the verb, enough information. What about here? Subject, we designed, designed is the verb, enough is the magic word, and promotion is the noun. There's no way out, guys. Is this confusing for you?
we need to practice this a lot. We need to practice this a lot. Hey, we don't have we don't have uh, many minutes left, so I gotta go towards the attendance to complete that process. Don't worry. Listen. Tomorrow we will continue. Yes, go ahead. Listen, and uh, can you uh, watch it the WhatsApp? The group WhatsApp? Yes, I can. Yes, and uh, you see the picture I stamp in WhatsApp. Please. Okay. I will check the picture, okay? I will check the picture out. I will reply to you tomorrow, all right? Okay. I will check on the platform. I need you help. Uh, for, <laughs> I need you help for, for um, the homework. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. I'm here for helping you. No problem, I Julio. I try, I try over and over again the, the different form and, and the... It's not working. Yeah. And, okay. And, I'm gonna check, I'm gonna check, I promise. And if there is a problem, I'm going to report that to management. They need to fix it. So remember, yeah. remember sometimes there are system glitches. So be patient with the platform, guys. Be patient. No worry, no worry. Okay, thank you. Let me finish the um, the um, attendance, okay? Lady Carolina Ventura de Valdez, are you still with us? Yes. I'm here, teacher. Appreciate your time. Angel Antonio Benitez Ventura. I'm here, teacher. Appreciate it. Angela Estefania Marroquin Martinez. Missing in action. Carmen Eugenia Treminio Reyes. I'm here, teacher. Thanks a lot. Daniel Arquimedes Florentino Garcia. I'm here, teacher. Appreciate it. Daniel Ezequiel Alvarez Mejia. Is he missing in action? Okay, let me see. There you go. Okay, um, Stella Mavel Orellana Andino. Present teacher. Present teacher. Jacqueline Sorry. Jesenia Miranda Rodriguez. Jaime Antonio Avelar Cortez. Jose Mario Valdez Gomez. Here, teacher. Thank you. Jose Rene Aguirre Chavarria. Present. Thank you. Juan Jose Lara Bautista. Present. Julio Cesar Merino Gonzalez. Present, sir. Catherine Lisette Cáceres Montesino. Present, mister. Already, Kathy Denise Soriano Villacorta. Present. Already, Kenny Lisette Cuellar de Barrientos. Here, present, teacher. Wonderful, Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present, teacher. Osbin, Alexis, Flores, Hernandez. Present. Sabrina, Lisette, Garcia, Orellana. Present. Maria Los, Janet, Cornejo, Erraso. Oh. Julio Cesar Ramirez, Arevalo. Present, teacher. Awesome. And let me see, Luis Alberto, Galicia, Hertrudis. And present. All right. And Cristian Josue, Lopez Perez. Present. All right. Perfect. I appreciate it. Guys, we will continue with this topic tomorrow. Again, I'm going to check what's going on with the platform. And hopefully I'm going to send you additional information about using enough plus nouns and enough plus adjectives so you can check that out yourself. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you. You have a good night, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow okay, at the same night. time. Good same place. Tomorrow, good night, everybody. Bye Sweet bye. Dreams. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Be safe. Good night. Be safe. Have a good night. Enjoy your sleep.